Okay, so we are on day two. We're going to finish outlining our door. And then looking at this example from the actual movie, most of the front of the doors are made with reds and yellows and oranges. So we are going to stay to a warm color palette for the inside of the door. If you want to make the outside a little darker, you may. But the majority of it is going to be done in the red, orange, and yellows. So just giving you that idea, you can use your crayons and colored pencils and color in all of your spaces with a level four craftsmanship nice and neat. Once it's all colored in nice and neat, I do have some special metallic markers or craft pens to add some details. Now we're not gonna color the whole thing in with these. These are just gonna be for some areas of emphasis or areas that we want to kind of make stand out. So you can pick some areas to color in with the bright gold nice and metallic and really make some spots just kind of stand out maybe make it a few lines here and there things like that so like I said we're not going to color in the whole thing with the gold but you can use it to make some of your door really shine all right after everything's colored you added your fun 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 gold there is one final step and it's when you open your door up now, as you can see, we can perfectly see through this paper. And we even got some color on this side. But luckily, I have another paper. What we're going to do is we are going to glue our extra paper down and then fold our door in half again and right on the inside. So once everything's colored and you've used that special marker, we're going to take this paper, glue it down, then we're going to write what our special gift is and what we are proud of ourselves for in this spot with full sentences. And then over here, if you want and have extra time, you can draw what you would think the inside of your room would be like they have in Encanto. So whatever you think your special power is. And then maybe if you want to draw and design the room inside, that would be really cool. So the last steps are to color in with a level four craftsmanship, all of it with warm colors, add some fun details with gold or silver special markers, take your paper, glue it on the inside, fold it in half again, write about your special gift, try to fill all of the lines with full senses, and then if you have extra time, draw what the inside of your room might look like on this side. Okay, I hope you enjoyed our Encanto project and I cannot wait to see your special doors.